I have four pieces in the show. Uh, so we did, uh, we worked on the Superman print based on a transparency that uh, was taken of the original painting. The original painting I did uh, in 1960 when I was a young boy. I found myself caught up in a whirlwind. The painting that I that was doing before Superman were typical type of abstract expressionism because I didn't want to do any, any more painting, abstract expressionist painting, so I thought that I was going to do something that put a smile on my face. And I was a big collector of uh, comic books as a kid. So uh, I just said, okay, I'll, I'll do a painting of Superman. And I had so much fun that I did a painting of Batman and a whole host of them all, including Wonder Woman. And the next thing I knew, pop art was born. Alloway Hall termed the whole thing pop art and paintings that dealt with popular culture, the superheroes, were, were a main part of it. They lumped me in with Roy Lichtenstein and, and Andy Warhol and Tom Wesselman, all of whom became friends of mine eventually. In 1962, I found myself reproduced in Time Magazine, and that was a big, big, big step for me. They just got a lot of attention because I was this, you know, this kind of bratty guy who was throwing the superheroes in their face. Uh, but in the end, uh, they embraced it. Most people embraced it. I think this show is fantastic. I think there's a couple of pieces in there that are masterpieces. Well, I'm just uh, flattered that they invited me, and that's, I'm, I'm just happy, uh, happy to be in it.